settings to find all the sites on your server. Um, it'll negotiate SSL certificates for you and install them. And uh, that's pretty cool. Uh, yeah, yeah, it, it's really. What do they charge for what they do? Nothing. It's Not free enough. now. So. And you, you can configure it so that it renews the certificate automatically for you. It's like you don't even have to. Even you can be hands off to set it up. Here it is. Get to your bash shell, type in git clone, that URL, cd, insert bot, and uh, run, the, run the program. And it's from the internet, so you know you can trust it. <laughs> but, yeah, so uh, the whole certificate market is kind of uh, <laughs> a little maybe. pissed off now. Yeah. Yeah. A little yeah. disrupted. Yeah, yeah, but you can't pay three hundred dollars a year to get the big green bar at the top. The extended validation it. It when you have the, uh, you know, serve, you know, you are at PayPal.com. Right. But yeah. if you look, like I think, I think you need to do the green bar. I don't think, yeah, does Amazon even do that? I don't think even Amazon does it. Oh yeah, and HTTPS is off by default. Oh, that's interesting. I didn't want I'm always going to. But even when you go there explicitly, it doesn't have the extended validation. But I think what's well, the place what happens when you click on the uh, eBay? On the way. Well, oh, click on the lock and see what give you. It's either a certificate authority. Yeah. Uh, semantic. So run this file one more time. So using Let's Encrypt is basically giving you the functionality of a uh, of an SSL certificate, or it really is an SSL certificate. It is. A, it is a uh, SSL certificate for your for your browser or for your site. And uh, so if you go to my site, so it's just um, automated issuance. And... Now I wonder what happens when you click on your. Yeah, click on that. It's going to crash. But no, <laughs> <you're just kidding. laughs> So you can view the certificate, and it says it's from Less Encrypt Authority, uh, but it's registered to my site specifically. Oh. And, uh, so how does that work, as opposed to having to buy certificates or something? Well, Less Encrypt uh, somehow Establish themselves as, as a secure uh, certificate authority, and I'm not sure what it takes for that. I don't know if they're uh, root authority or what, but um, I'm the impression they completely automated the whole process. Of, they did, yep. you know, so it's become so cheap for them. I'm not sure what that And I think they have been around for quite a while, but the the number of uh, certificates that they're issuing is kind of grown exponentially. Well, there I think they had been around for several years, and but then within uh, between of December of 2014 and December of 2015, they issued um, like a million certificates in that period of time. Between December and now, they've issued another million certificates. It looks like they're powered by a 501c3 out of California. Well, it says that they have major supporters here. So and then major like supporters. I mean, yeah, they're a nonprofit, and then they have people uh, supporting it. It's interesting players. Interest Internet Security Research Group. Hmm. I wonder if they have some really promoting the use of certificates for encryption. I think so because you know more and more Cisco, of the web is trying to get secure. Right there. Yeah, yeah. I think, yeah. yeah. And Facebook. One thing to keep yeah. in mind though is but that if you do, of course, all that encryption is going to be illegal here shortly. <laughs> <laughs> right. Uh, one, one thing to keep in mind though is that if you do want to have a web proxy service like security or uh, the other one um, that you'll need them they will need to uh, support SSL certificates because they will actually become the endpoint for people visiting your site uh, rather than your site uh, they will just be forwarding the traffic to and from your site and filtering out malicious requests and things like that uh, but they all offer SSL certificates now I think security's base plan offers a uh, SSL certificate through Less Encrypt, so. And, and a Cloudflare did that too, they offered SSL. Sure, coverage. yeah, they had to get on that pretty quick. Yeah, so. they had to, oh crap. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's good they're doing that. Well, I should 
probably shut it down here. That's good. Yeah, really good, good stuff. Sober up throughout the talk? I did sober up, yeah. <laughs>